Overnight, those storms did cause some damage in Central Texas. We have team coverage this morning. Let's start with Jacqueline Sarkisi, and she's live in Williamson County now. How are things out there this morning, Jacqueline? They're making progress. Just moments ago, the train just hooked up to the other part of the train. So what happened? Crews moved the derailed cars off of the track and reconnected the two parts that are still on the track. And that's exactly what the spokesperson for Union Pacific said was their entire goal this morning to get traffic going, to get the train going. They said as for the derailed cars, they're going to be working on this well into the evening and even until tomorrow morning. Morning. So he advises people driving on Highway 79, please be extra safe. Use caution equipment will be coming and going all throughout the day. Again, the train, it actually started moving as well. So all morning long, we've got this situation happening. And then if you come over here, we have power poles that have been snapped. There's numerous ones just all along Highway 79. So again, if you're in Williamson County on Highway 79, be extra safe. Thousands of people are without power this morning and the National Weather Service is expected to come by to Williamson County sometime later today to survey the damage and see if in fact a tornado did touch down in this county. Now let's send over to Tanya where she's in Travis County. Tanya.